Namaste everyone. Today I'll be talking about a series that's uh, streaming on Disney Plus Hotstar called Six Feet Under. And uh, it's about life and death because it's set in a funeral home family. And uh, I won't recommend it for kids or young adults because it might give them too much to think about. But at the same time, I think that it will uh, be a good eye opener or not an eye opener, but a thinker for mature aud audiences out there. All right. So without further ado, let me just get my usual pull ups out of the way. And then I'm Akshat. Thank you so much for tuning into my vlog and uh, talk about six feet under in just a minute. Thanks so much for watching this short and here are pull ups. Okay, that didn't turn out to be a shot, but maybe I'll edit it down later. But coming back to six feet under, it's like I said about life and death because the characters, the main characters are part of a family who run a funeral home in America, of course. Uh, we, of course, uh, have funeral pyres on the banks of the Ganges and other holy water bodies. But okay, let's not get off to a <laughs> you know depressing start. But let's think about how thinking about uh, death can help you improve your life. So we are all mortal, right? We are gonna die sometime. And uh, that's just something for you to begin thinking about. Uh, the series basically takes us uh, through a through the lives of a diverse cast, you know, so I mean they're white, uh, but uh, they interact with a huge cross section of society, and uh, the family is like uh, father who has just died when the season when the series starts, who was running the funeral home. He has an apprentice who he has educated and everything. Uh, he has two sons and a daughter. The daughter is still in uh, high school, college when the series starts. And uh, uh, the widowed mother. So I think this is the main cast. And uh, they, like I said, live their lives, their fictional lives, of course, uh, interacting with a whole wide world out there. And this WWW. <laughs> is the source of lots of dark sarcasm and humor all right so i'll call my vertical video to an end here do check out six feet under i'm akshat thanks for watching and basically i needed to pick up my water bottle against which the camera was resting okay so What do we think about when we think about our mortality? Basically, for me at least individually, it drives me to do something uh, constructive with life, not just go through the motions of life. Uh, but I guess, like I said, mature audiences will get this better because they have kind of lived life for a longer time than I have. Uh, but yeah, if you try and uh, inspire other people to find a, uh, find a way to express their individuality in a constructive manner, then I guess you're doing something worthwhile. At least that's what I try with these unedited vlogs. So if you've checked out my previous vlogs, I talk about space a lot. I want humanity to become spacefaring. And of course, pop culture, sports. But uh, commentating on <laughs> live things or reacting to past things is cool and all. What I really look forward to is a future in which 
वी आर यूजिंग टेक्नोलॉजी टू एनहेंस द क्वालिटी ऑफ लाइफ एंड दैट्स वॉट दिस सीरीज ओ बाय द वे इट्स प्रेटी ओल्ड प्रेटी 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 ओल्ड एज लैरी डेविड वुड से एंड दैट्स वाई इट डजेंट हैव टू मच टेक्नोलॉजी इंक्लूडिंग ऑन द कैरेक्टर्स लाइव I mean, they've just got like you know, they've just started to get mobile phones to stay connected all the time, which is something most of us can't even imagine life without. Am I right? Because take away your phone, and who are you? Take away your internet, and how will you be who you are? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I guess uh, apart from the idyllic lives in the mountains that are ideal as well as idyllic. uh we got to live in the real world and 6 feet under shows us a nice uh glimpse of how things can be mostly satirically and with a very dark humor but uh it sometimes makes me uh, you know laugh at the mm, randomness of life all right so as we head out towards the end of my vlog about 6 feet under i'll say that uh, it's a must watch and uh, okay so when i have watched it all through over the next few months like i did with the sopranos it took me couple of years of uh, you know watching when i had off times uh then i'll write about it on stack me also that reminds me thank you for watching till the end and you can check out my science fiction book it's on stack me that's what reminded me about this and the link is in the description it's a science fiction thing about uh the first solo female space pilot uh, uh between uh, earth and mars and moon uh, where she was born and grew up <laughs> and it's called an android awake uh, awoke because an android awakes to sentience you know free will uh, on the moon so that's where it starts and uh, read it to see how it ends i'm writing part 2 as well i'm going to call it the marsium chronicles so with that i bid you adieu and uh once again i'm akshat thank you so much for watching namaste take care stay safe